Okay, I'm back. Um, as you can see, the board was also designed to work with the Amulet Gems Press 2. And uh, the only thing that you do is you just unplug it from the microchip and then just remove one bridge. And then you have the board working with the same display. I don't have a nice uh, or fancy demo for the Amulet. However, uh, it'll be easy to see uh, how even the uh, touch resist work, okay? okay? Let me see, I don't, okay, there you go, now you can see it, okay? So you see, yeah. So that's basically it, you know? It is uh, designed to work with two different boards and uh, that's the type of work that it does okay you see you saw the you saw those ports there before those are just to mount the, the amulet okay now this one the serial port and the usb port work with the amulet and uh, this one these ports are shared with with the peak I mean with the Epson pigtail and with the Amulet Gem Express. So the thing is the two boards can't work together, that's kind of obvious. But um, in any case, that's the thing. And then you also have to switch these uh, jumpers so you get access uh, to the uh, touch of the Gem Express. If you move them this way, you have access to the touch of the pig, okay? So that's it. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you want to buy one of these things or, you know, ask some questions about it.